Sutra 13, with perfect penetration of the six sense organs, the light and what is illumined are not two. Encompassing the ten directions, a great perfect mirror stands in the empty treasury of the first come one. I inherit the secret Dharma doors of as many first come one as there find most of dust throughout the ten directions. Receiving them without loss, I am able to make it so that trellis living beings throughout the Dharma realm who seek daughters are blessed with lovely daughters who are upright, virtuous, and compliant, and whom everyone cherishes and respects. Commentary 13th With perfect penetration of the six sense organs, the light and what is illumined are not two encompassing the ten directions and a great perfect mirror stands in the empty treasury of the first common the eyes ears nose tongue body and mind are unobstructed and perfectly interpenetrated everything comes together to one the six organs function interchangeably it is as if the huge mirror was set up and the treasury of the first common is empty i inherit the secret Dharma doors of as many first come ones as they find most of dust throughout the ten directions. Receiving them without lots, I am able to make it so that childless living beings throughout the Dharma realm who seek sick daughters are blessed with lovely daughters who are upright, virtuous and compliant, and whom everyone cherishes and respects. If someone wants a daughter, they will have a daughter who is proper, has a virtue, and is easy to get along with. Everyone who sees this girl will be fond of her and respect her. She will be a lovely girl with perfect features. Sutra 14. In this 3,000 great thousand world system, with its billions of suns and moons, as many Dharma princes as their grains of sand in 62 Ganges rivers appear in the world and cultivate the Dharma. They act as models in order to teach and transform living beings. They comply with living beings by means of experience and wisdom in different ways for each. Commentary The 14th kind of fearlessness. This 3,000 great thousand world system with its billions of suns and moons as many Dharma princes as their grains of sand in 62 Ganges rivers appear in the world, they are living in the world right now, and cultivate the Dharma. They act as models in order to teach and transform living beings. They comply with the wishes of living beings and means of experience and wisdom. They use skilly means and provisional wisdom in different ways for each kind of living being that is ready to be taught since each being is different. Sutra However, because I have obtained the perfect penetration of the, of the sense organ and have discovered the wonder of the ear entrance, after which my body and mind subtly and miraculously included all of the Dharma realm, I am able to make it so that living being so uphold who uphold my name obtain as much merit and virtue as would be obtained by a person who upheld the names of all those Dharma princes who are as many as the grains of sand in 62 Ganges rivers. Commentary However, because I have obtained the perfect penetration of the sense organ and have discovered the wonder of the ear engines, I, Konshin Bodhisattva, obtained perfect penetration through the organ of the ear and realized the subtleties of the ear, after which my body and mind subtly and miraculously included all in the Dharma realm. This subtle state pervaded everything throughout the Dharma realm. Therefore, I am able to make it so that living beings who uphold my name, who recite the name of Konshin Bodhisattva, obtain as much merit and virtue as would be obtained by a person who upheld the names of all those Dharma princes who are as many as the grains of sand in 62 Ganges rivers. One person recites only the name of Kwanshin Bodhisattva, and another person recites the names of as many Bodhisattvas 
as their sons in 62 Ganges rivers. The reward of blessings and each person obtains will be identical. This shows how magnificent the merit and virtue of country and Bodhisattva are. Sutra, warned honored one, there is no difference between the merit of my one name and the merit of those many other names, because from my cultivation I obtained true and perfect penetration. Commentary, warned honored one, there is no difference between the merit of my one name the name country in Bodhisattva and the merit of those many other names, that is, the Bodhisattvas who are as many as the grains of sand in 62 Ganges rivers. How can this be? How can the merit of one name be the same as that of so many? It is because from my cultivation I obtained true and perfect penetration. Sutra, these are called the 14 powers of bestowing fearlessness with them, I bless living beings. Commentary These are called the 14 powers of bestowing fearlessness. With them, I bless living beings. I come to their aid. Whenever someone seeks something, I will respond. Sutra Moreover, won't honored one, because I obtained perfect penetration and cultivated to certification of the unsurpassed path. I also became endowed with four inconceivable and infamous wonderful virtues. First, as soon as I obtained the miraculous wonder of hearing the mind, the mind became essential and the hearing was forgotten. Therefore, there was no distinction between seeing, hearing, sensation, and knowing. I achieved a single perfect fusion, pure and precious enlightenment. For this reason, I am able to manifest many wonderful appearances and can proclaim about these secret spiritual mantras. Commentary Moreover, won't honored one, because I obtained perfect penetration and cultivated to certification of the unsurpassed path, I also became endowed with four inconceivable and effortless wonderful virtues. What are these four inconceivable virtues? First, as soon as I obtained the miraculous wonder of hearing the mind, the mind became essential and the hearing was forgotten. When I first acquired the skill of returning the hearing to hear the self-nature, that wonder of wonders, my mind became essential and the hearing was forgotten. The true mind manifests and one which is an essential and wonderful place. Once the hearing disappeared, there was no distinction between seeing, hearing, sensation, and knowing. The other sensations were interfused and could not be divided. I achieved a single perfect fusion, pure and precious enlightenment. This means he accomplished a oneness, a oneness without um, any distinctions between self and others. For this reason, I am able to manifest many wonderful appearances and can proclaim Bali's secret spiritual mantras. Sutra, for example, I may make a pure one hat, three hats, five hats, seven hats, nine hats, eleven hats, and so forth until there may be a hundred and eight hats, a thousand hats, ten thousand hats, or eighty-four thousand vara hats. Commentary not only does Kuan Yin Bodhisattva have a thousand hands and a thousand eyes, but also Marat has as many as 84,000 of them. The appearances which Kuan Yin Bodhisattva makes include, he says, one hat, three hats, the three-faced Kuan Yin, five hats, the five-faced Kuan Yin, seven hats, the seven-faced Kuan Yin, and nine hats, eleven hats, and so forth, until there may be a hundred and eight hats, a thousand hats, ten thousand hats, or eighty-four thousand vara hats. Vara means strong and firm. Sutra: Two arms, four arms, six arms, eight arms, ten arms, twelve arms, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen arms, or twenty arms, twenty-four arms, and so forth, until there may be a hundred and eight arms, a thousand arms, ten thousand arms, or eighty-four thousand mudra arms. Commentary, Kuan Yin Bodhisattva can also manifest two arms, 
4 arms, 6 arms, 8 arms, 10 arms, 12 arms, 14, 16, 18 arms, or 20 arms, 24 arms, or perhaps he manifests 108 arms, 1,000 arms, 10,000 arms, as many as 84,000 mudra arms. Mudra is a Sanskrit word that means seal hand. On one hand, there is a seal imprint. Sutra, two eyes, three eyes, four eyes, nine eyes, and so forth, until there may be a hundred and eight eyes, a thousand eyes, ten thousand eyes, or eighty-four thousand pure and precious eyes. Sometimes compassionate, sometimes awesome, sometimes in samadhi, sometimes displaying wisdom to rescue and protect living beings so that they may attain great self-mastery. Commentary, the Dharma body of Kwanit Bodhisattva can manifest two eyes, three eyes, four eyes, nine eyes, and so forth, until there may be a hundred and eight eyes, a thousand eyes, ten thousand eyes, or eighty-four thousand pure and precious eyes. How can Kwan Shri Bodhisattva manifest so many transformations and appearances? It is because he cultivated the great compassion mantra and the forty-two hands and eyes on the coarse ground, so that on the ground of fusion, when his cultivation was perfected, he had endless transformations. Sometimes compassionate, sometimes awesome, sometimes in samadhi, sometimes displaying wisdom, his eyes are perhaps compassionate or maybe their light is awesome. Perhaps his eyes display the light of samadhi or of wisdom. He appears this way in order to rescue and protect living beings so that they may attain great self-mastery. Sutra. Second, because of hearing and consideration, I escaped the six defiling objects just as the sound leaves over a wall without hindrance, and so I have the wonderful ability to not manifest shape after shape and to recite mantra upon mantra. These shapes and these mantras dispel the fears of living beings. Therefore, throughout the ten directions, in as many lands as there are fine most of dust. I am known as one who bestows fearlessness. Commentary, the second effortless, wonderful virtue, because of hearing and consideration. I escaped the six defiling objects. I cultivated the wisdom of hearing and the wisdom of consideration and got out of forms, smells, tastes, objects of touch, and dhammas. I was not attached to them. I was just as a sound leaves over a wall without hindrance. And so I have the wonderful ability to manifest shape after shape and to recite mantra upon mantra. These shapes I appear in and these mantras I recite dispel the fears of living beings. They have the power of bestowing fearlessness. Therefore, throughout the ten directions, in as many lands, as they are fine most of dust, I am known as one who bestows fearlessness. Sutra. Third, because I cultivated fundamental, wonderful, perfect penetration and purified the sense organ, everywhere I go in any world, I can make it so that living beings renounce their physical and material valuables to seek my sympathy. Commentary. Third, because I cultivated fundamental, Wonderful, perfect penetration and purified the sense organ. He is referring to the fundamental purity of the ear organ, the hearing nature. Everywhere I go in any world, I can make it so that living beings renounce their physical and material valuables to seek my sympathy. They will give up their very bodies and lives and their valuable possessions in search of my aid. Sutra fourth, I obtained the Buddha's mind and was certified as having attained the ultimate end, and so I can make offerings of rare treasuries up to the first come ones of the ten directions and to living beings in the six paths throughout the Dharma realm. Commentary the fourth inconceivable and effortless wonderful virtue. I obtained the Buddha's mind and was certified as having attained the ultimate end. I obtained the true mind of the treasury of the first common. Ultimate end means the final fruition of Buddhahood, and so I can make offerings of rare treasuries 
So the first come ones of the ten directions, and two living beings in the six paths throughout the Dharma realm. Whatever they want, I will fulfill their wishes. Sutra: If they seek a spouse, they obtain a spouse. If they seek children, they can have children. Seeking samadhi, they obtain samadhi. Seeking long life, they obtain long life, and so forth. To the extent that if they seek the great nirvana, they obtain great nirvana. Commentary: Whatever living beings in the six paths wish, will be granted them. Kuan Yin Bodhisattva realizes that everyone wants a good spouse. So if they seek a spouse, they obtain a spouse. If they want a good wife, they will find a beautiful one. That's the foremost wish of living beings. Once they have a spouse, they hope for good children. So the second thing Kuan Yin Bodhisattva does is grant children. If they seek children, they can have children. If they want sons, they get sons. If they wish for daughters, they will have daughters. Third, he says, seeking samadhi, they obtain samadhi. Seeking long life, they obtain long life. If one has a wife and children and still feels that there is no meaning to human life, and so brings forth a resolve to transcend the world and seek a samadhi, then one can attain samadhi. Some are seeking long life, and so they obtain long life. They want to become immortal and never die, and they are able to do so, and so forth to the extent that if they seek the great nirvana, they obtain great nirvana. If being seek to become a Buddha, they can attain the fruition of Buddhahood. Sutra: The Buddha asks about perfect penetration. From the gateway of the ear, I obtained a perfect and illumining samadhi. The conditioned mind was at ease, and therefore I entered the appearance of the flow and obtaining samadhi. I accomplished bodhi. This is the foremost method. Commentary: The Buddha asks about perfect penetration. The Buddha asked all his disciples how they first obtained. The expedient of perfect penetration from the gateway of the ear, I obtained a perfect and illumining samadhi. I cultivated the nature of hearing and accomplished samadhi power. The conditioned mind was at ease, and therefore I entered the appearance of the flow and obtaining samadhi. I accomplished bodhi. This is the foremost method. The mind that clamps on conditions was gone, was gone, and I attained self mastery. I returned the hearing to hear the self nature, and the nature accomplished the unsurpassed way. This is the best method. Sutra, world honored one, that Buddha, the first come one, praised me as having obtained well the Dharma door of perfect penetration. In the great assembly, he bestowed a prediction upon me and the name Quan Shi Yin. Commentary: Word honored one, that Buddha, the first come one, praised me as having obtained well the Dharma door of perfect penetration. That Buddha refers to the Quan Shi Yin, first come one of old. He praised the ease with which I obtained perfect penetration. In the great assembly. He bestowed a prediction upon me and the name Quan Shi. He named me contemplator of the world south, the same name he had himself, Sutra, because my contemplation and listening is perfectly clear throughout the ten directions. The name Quan Shi pervades all the realms of the ten directions. Commentary: Because my contemplation and listening is perfectly clear throughout the ten directions. That is, because every place throughout the ten directions, to the bounds of the Dharma realm, came together, and I experienced a perfect clarity. Therefore, the name Quan Shi Yin pervades all the realms of the ten directions, in every Buddha land, throughout the ten directions. The name Quan Shi Yin is known.